Greetings, travelers. I'm Enra Silver, and welcome to Episode 6 of Starfield Shipwright. In this episode, I'm going to show you the interiors of all the 2x1 control station halves, like I've done with the previous 2x1 half videos. In my head, I split each half into a middle section and two end sections. Things in the middle section stay pretty much unchanged, but when you snap other halves or portholes to the ends of each half, whatever is in that area will be deleted or rearranged. I'm going to go through each hab with full interior decoration, then I'll show you the same hab with porthole snapped to every point to show you what you sacrifice if you attach a door or a porthole to a specific spot. Another thing to point out, all the control station habs come with 5 hull and 4 crew. Now let's start with Demos. The Demos 2x1 control station is well lit like most Demos habs. Fairly clear, a few things on the floor, but they're stacked neatly. The four control stations are all in the middle, while one end has storage and a table, and the other end has a couple lockers. And here is the same hab with six portholes snapped to the sides. The Nova control station is dimmer than the Demos, with things stacked not quite so neatly. The stations are a bit more spread out, with one end having a table and the other a small kitchen. There's also a large crate on the floor. Here's the same hab with portholes snapped to each point. Notice now the control stations are closer together, and the large crate stays on the ground, but the table is gone. Next is Stroud Eklund. Their take on the control station hab has the control stations tightly grouped in the center like Demos but both ends have work tables with monitors on them. One end has storage, while the other has lockers. And this is what the hab looks like with the portholes snapped to all six sides. The Hope Tech control station hab has the usual four mirrored stations on each side of the middle, while one end is entirely storage. The other end has a desk with a backpack stand. This is what the Hope Tech Hab looks like with six portholes. And finally is Tayo. The Tayo Control Station Hab looks very similar in layout to the Hope Tech, just slightly better lit and tidy. This is what it looks like with six portholes. And that's going to do it for the interior of the control station halves. Thanks for hanging around until the end. Hopefully you found some useful info. If you enjoyed the content, like that smash button, comment, and subscribe. I'm Endra Silver. Now it's time for me to make like a tree and leave.